It's not often that a Class AA basketball team gets the opportunity to go for a third consecutive state championship, but that's exactly what the Billings Skyview boys are doing this season. The Falcons split a state title in 2020 and won it outright last season. There's some new faces on this year's team, but one of those key holdovers is senior guard Peyton Sanders. And it was even more important that Peyton was out those first couple preseason games because the other guys got to step up and fill those roles, uh, kind of get those jitters out of the way and um, just feel what it's like to be on the varsity pace and on the varsity floor. It's definitely a different pace in the JV. Uh, we're just hoping within our program that it just builds like that, that we go through and from the JV level, it just turns over into good varsity experience. Skyview briefly played without its floor general, but the Falcons are undoubtedly a better team with Sanders out there running the show. In fact, he's currently 7th in Class AA in scoring at 16 per game and 2nd in assists at 5.5 a, a night. But the question coming into the season was who would step up next to Sanders. Someone said it was a good band name. I think Shirting said that. It was Peyton Sanders and the Unknowns, you know. That was kind of the mindset. Like I, I was telling these guys like the Lane and the Reese and all those that they need to just be ready. And, and, and when their name's called that they'll have to step up. But now hopefully uh, at the box scores and as we get into games, all these kids coming off the bench for us, the juniors and the sophomores and then the seniors too as well. You know, I got to get everybody the ball and everybody to score because... You know, they gotta, they gotta be comfortable and I gotta give them the opportunity just like I got the opportunity. You just gotta throw them into the fire, you know. They, they're, they're gonna survive, you know. They, this is the varsity level, so you gotta, you gotta bring it. Now Skyview stumbled a bit this past week, losing to both Billings West and Billings Senior, the Falcons' first two losses in conference play. Skyview will learn from those games as they move towards the postseason and will look to be playing its best ball in a matter of weeks. Uh, we just need to work on ourselves, you know, turnovers, you know, making shots, you know, just the whole gameplay. You know, we have a long ways to go and we're, we're here for it. We're here to go the long run. Skyview back in action on Thursday at Bozeman Gallatin. For MTN Sports, I'm Alec Boffinger.